Hello, my name is Dennis, and this is my partner Dario. We're researchers from Macau and finalists at ISAF. Today, we are excited to introduce our project, a bio-inspired robotic tail exoskeleton. Before we build a tail, we ask ourselves a simple question. What problem are we solving? The answer, falling. Yes, it sounds minor, but it can be deadly. There are over 680,000 deaths from falls each year. And that's why... Exactly, just like that. That's why we built a tail, to stop that from happening. Our design is inspired by animals like cats and kangaroos, masters of balance thanks to their tail. If this works for them, why not adapt it for humans? Now let's talk about our tail's design. Our tail is engineered with three degrees of freedoms, which allows it to move forward, backwards, sideways, and even rotate. Our innovative retractable mechanism keeps the tail compact when not in use, because walking around with a full-length tail 24-7 might raise some eyebrows. We map our flexible tail kinematics into a classical RRP robotic arm system, which simplifies the calculation of the exact angle and extensions. So how does our system work? First, our system detects body tilts using a partial sensor, processes it through linearization, scaling, and inverse kinematic to calculate the needed tail extension. And the brushless DC motor adjusts movement with a closed-loop motor controller. With real-time feedback, our tail dynamically stabilizes the user for instant balance. Our first experiment models human balance using talk to simulate tripping. A rotatable top pivot mimic movement. With a servo motor for core motion and a low sound measuring talk during tilting. Our experiment reveals the relationship between talk versus sign of feature to enhance balance. Without the tail, talk increased linearly with tilt, indicating instability. With the tail, the talk loop decreased showing a gentler gravitational response. Optimizing the control parameter improved balance reliability and effectiveness, which strongly validates our concept. This, this is the end of our presentation. Thank you.